Don't do it. <laughs> Our cart's gonna die. How's everybody doing? Bill Binder, Binder Stash. Saturday, out on the golf course. I was on the couch, but then Tiger shot a 65, and I got all pumped up. So, grab the bottle of Russell's Reserve. This is the single barrel. Usually they have barrel picks of this stuff, but this is just the regular stuff. I really, really like it. I have it in, in my cabinet at home. It's solid. Those wild turkey boys, Jimmy, Eddie, they do good things. This is really, really good stuff. Coming in at 55% alcohol, 110 proof. What do they call it? Uh, alligator char. Char number four, the deepest one. Uh, non chill filtered, less water diluted, so you get more flavor out of it. I'm gonna take a big swig of this right now, and then I'm gonna hit this three wood off this tee on this golf course that is so tough, it's ridiculous. So, cheers. Swing oil. Now I have this ridiculous chip. That's gotta go down the hill. After it goes down the hill, it's gonna go down another hill. And then it's gonna go dead right down to the freaking water. So, let's see. Let's see what happens here. Let's see what Mr. Bender can do with this. Guess what? You can't get angry at that. I don't play golf anymore. And when I do, I try to have as much fun as I can. Soaking a cigar, I'm drinking a good whiskey, hitting ball around. I don't have my putter. I don't need my putter. Now we're going to the next hole. See what happens. Um. Well, they definitely hit a home run with this one, but this isn't new, this is just a staple. So I guarantee the people that are watching me right now talk about this, they've already had it. Now, I tasted it pre and post cigar, and I'm not really losing anything on the palate, which is great. Um, very subtle on the nose. Uh, the one thing I do get is that s'mores, like burnt s'mores. And that's gotta do with that number four alligator char that these boys use, it's like 75% corn, 13% rye, uh, and the rest of malt barley. Um, it's really light on the front. It gets super sweet vanilla caramel on the front palate. Maybe a little herbal in there, it's weird. I don't know, I can't put my finger on it. But then, you know, you get that 110 in the back, back palate. Uh, this stuff all around is is uh, definitely something that everybody should have in their liquor cabinet. Um, this stuff is solid, it's smooth, it's got that kick to it from 110 proof, which is what I like, because uh, I don't like weak stuff. Get that weak stuff out of here. I like the strong stuff. Um, the barrel picks, I assume, are a little bit different. Uh, I've had one, it's not too far from this, but it's definitely different in some aspects. Um, Jimmy Russell, Eddie Russell, hands hands down, hats off. Uh, this is great stuff. Freaking wild turkey boys. You got a winner with this one. Obviously everybody knows that. You should know that. I definitely know that. Um, it's no 98 though, it's no 98. And those of you who know what I'm talking about out there know that that 98 is ridiculous. Uh, so I'm gonna sit here 
and I'm gonna smoke this Tatuaje 2009 and I'm gonna sip the rest of this Jimmy Russell because again this is just we just shout out to the golf course got inspired by Tiger 65 today what went out cold pulled glue pulled hamstring I'm an old mess with a beard it's all I am it drinks whiskey and smokes cigars so let's have some fun okay all right fuck out of here All right, so we're in between twosomes right now. We got the ladies in front of us. Got the guys behind us, but I don't see them yet, so we're gonna take another swig of this. Yeah. But this is really good stuff for the price point and the fact that you can still find it is amazing. Uh, I don't know about the next year or next two years, you might not be able to find it. Um, Thanks for spending the afternoon with us. Again, this is the shotgun. This is a shotgun. Let's get out here and review a bottle and let's go pick something out that I like. And that's what we found. Uh, thank you, Tiger Woods, for shooting a 65 today and inspiring me to come out in these conditions. It's about to pour. Um, but I had to get out and I had to hit the round ball because that's what happens when you watch good golfers play good golf. So. For all of us here, Binder's Stash, remember, always enjoy what you drink.